here's how to make cupstick. Top serving. Already chopped up. Well, thin slice. Thin slices. So now she's currently adding. What is that, Grandma? Is that corn oil? Yeah. Pure corn oil. Even though this skillet don't need no grease. Y'all see that skillet? Oh, baby, baby. That looks like cheese will float up off this skillet. Now we have the cutting board. The meat. And she's ripping out a bowl. And I cut it in small pieces, and then I wash it after I cut it. Let's just turn the block because it was in the fridge from last night. I'm just fine. Good cooking right here. I'm gonna cut the, take the little fat off. Now she's cleaning her meat. You gotta show the camera, Grandma, what she using. She used a stone meal. Black pepper. Any black pepper. <laughs> okay, you just gonna say Come out faster. The light on? No, it ain't coming out. No, I'm saying go. um in the kitchen. So uh -huh. you know. Okay. That's enough. And paprika. 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 Paprika make it brown. Put that piece back in there. Get all the pepper stick. Might need it. I'll just guess. I just guess. Water. Water. It looks good. It smells seasoned. Water. Then you just add a little flour to it. Let it brown. How much flour are you using? I just coat it. I guess it everything. And it turns out perfect. It doesn't every actually time. matter because uh, it's going to make the gravy. So you can put as much as you want. Oh, yeah. Dad normally does the gravy after. Or yeah. puts does the flour afterwards. Dad yeah, does. It's different. He started out doing it the way I do it. He must have changed his recipe. And watched it boom again. After. More. Hmm. See, it depends on how much meat you have. Okay, now it's ready to drop. Just gotta see if this grease is warm enough. I'm just throwing this skillet to Feel like it's hot to me. No, I got to get to the hot top at the top. Flour, not water. I had to learn that the hard way. You see, never it's, put. It's not that hot. That water well, pops on you. Yeah, water always pops. So don't do water, do flour. If you're checking your grease. 
I used to do water. Never knew. Because you're just going to brown it. Getting top, she has this nice, beautiful cover here. How I do mine. Down the middle? Nope. Yeah. Then I separate them and I put it over in it. Everybody do it different. You do ring? Yep, but I separate them like this. When I put it in there, I just separate it. If you want to do cut it in half, you can cut it in half. It's up to you. Girl, mama asked for a bag of cut onions because I can't cut onions. Why cut them? Just let Why them know I'm gonna get some goggles. You, they say you cut it under run, running water. Just to just minimize it. Yeah. Why do onions make you cry? I don't know. Comment below and tell us why you think onions make you cry. There you go. Now your onions, everything is ready, so you just... Finish this, brown in it. I'm gonna add a little water and soy sauce. But I'm gonna make sure your meat is done, nice and brown. Because that's where you're gonna get the gravy from. Mmm. Keep turning it this way. Don't wow. I'm gonna tear this up. Mmm. 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 So this is what I'm using. Handy. That's what Oh, it's an 
I'm turning the temperature down. And it wants to start boiling a little bit. I can't wait to set this up. I didn't know soy sauce was in here. Watch it, Lonnie. Don't drop it. I just put it in for the curry. It's not that much, so I'm just going to dump the whole thing. Hopefully it tastes good. Oh, oh. Swish it around. Then you just let it cook. Yeah. Nice and yeah. And then you can add your peppers. And cook your rice. Monday. And you know, you put some rice, maybe make some corn or something on the side. Yeah, it's always good with corn. It depends on what you want to go with. Rice and corn. Look at the onions. They just smoothing out. Thing to Uncle Ben. Uncle Ben? Yeah. Uncle it's, Ben's it's rice? Just, yeah, it's just like Uncle Ben's rice. Uh -huh. it's, it's like a knockoff. Uh -huh. knock <laughs> <laughs> but it's good. It's good. Like Uncle Ben's rice, though. Yeah. peppers are in here we're gonna go ahead and fast forward to when it's all said and done mm, can't wait to enjoy this is the final dish so delicious thanks for tuning in hope you stay tuned for many more grandma's famous dishes pepper steak Ooh.